for your host, a one Mr. Christopher <laughs> Apple now has enough money to buy every sports league in the world, which is nuts. And you can tell that some leagues are getting ready for it because these are the new uniforms for the NBA this year. <laughs> uh, Bloomingdale's uh, just apologized uh, for an ad that encouraged date rape. But what's worse, this is their fall sweater line. <laughs> so, but so Listerine sort of invented this idea that there was something called halitosis, which was a disease that you could have. But they ran ads that were like, you know, you could have halitosis without even knowing it, and everyone you know will secretly hate you, so buy Listerine and wash your mouth with it. You can look this up. They ran ads like this, and they still do today. They ran them for 100 years, and that was, that's like where the term halitosis came from. They coined the term. Um, and uh, yeah, that's another... So in like yeah. 75 years... People are just gonna accept like fourth meal as a as a cultural thing because right now <laughs> yes right now Taco Bell runs ads that we should have a fourth meal yes <laughs> now I know what you're thinking who would say something terrible about that a lot of people <laughs> is the comment a a defense of a horrible German dictator. B, lyrics from the bare necessities. <laughs> C, writing that Beyonce surfboard line 400 times. You guys going C? Are we split between A and C? All right, what do you think? C, it's A. <laughs> a defensive of a horrible Jim German dictator, and the line is, for once I think Adolf Hitler is kind of correct. <laughs> no context, also he spelled it Adolf Hitter, <laughs> which is what you would call like an asshole on your baseball team. <laughs> like you're really being an Adolf Hitter right now. <laughs> back, back to Welcome to Night Vale, you have people making all kinds of fan art about specifically your two characters. Has there no. been anything extremely disturbing? By disturbing, I also mean a huge honor. Uh, but one fan drew me truly as a four-year-old girl toddler <laughs> and it said Dylan Marin the little queen of Brooklyn <laughs> and I was like no truer title has ever been written of me I mean I do I do remember the day that I found uh the sort of Night Vale after dark tumblr um which right, was sounds uh, good. which was I mean great you know uh it was it was a lot of our characters, not even us, like, you know, because we make this podcast, like, we're not, the, we're not the faces of these characters. Right. We're just, you know, the actors that supply the voices. And people took that and then added a lot of tentacles. <laughs> <laughs> and a lot of fucking. I be pressing death, you be dressed to get shitted, huh? She think that I'm Mr. Right, but I think I'm committed, bro. Girl look like a dick, but she's one of a million. Y'all keep it a hundred, I'm a thousand like a kiloton. Just look at my daddy if you wanna know who I get it from. Just look at my mommy if you wanna know how I get it done. You scared you're a messy, you a messy with my spirit gun. Just look at my feet if you concerned with how my cities run. Size nine and a half with your ass, keep a shoebox for the stash. Many more fish in the sea, gotta keep a line for the bass. Y'all wait in line for the class. Yeah, I just get it. I ain't in a hall with a pass. I just count money, call it bad. Don't fuck at you, call it science. Fuck a bad bitch, call it gym. We gon' run them laps. Y'all go on a day. 1 a.m. is once we fuck with me. You be saving hoes, and your squad looks like the Justice League. I don't really fight, but if you bucking, then we knuckling. You a struggle rapper, you should rap more than you. I'm in with Dexter's. What? What? I can make it work. Yeah. Uh, I could use my right, I could use my fucking left I don't need no fucking help Yeah, uh, I'm in protection What? What? I can make it work Yeah, uh, I could use my right, I could use my fucking left I don't need no fucking help Charlie Brown? Oh, Charlie Brown I can't, I can't believe it. She must think I'm the most stupid person alive. 